24. Here's meteorologist Tom DeVecchio, your weather authority. We have some sunshine, a few clouds starting to, to pop up here and there. And of course, it's blocking the sun naturally as we go on the air, at least to there at the Erie Insurance Arena. As uh, we check things out on the Bayfront, uh, this is our Kerr's Tire Corner weather cam just up the street. And uh, we do have, again, some pretty good sunshine. You can see a lot of sun out over the lake. But as is often the case this time of year, probably some puffy clouds will be redeveloping. But still, looking like a great afternoon. So we'll have uh, some uh, breaks in those clouds. Already we're seeing them. Looks mild and breezy for tomorrow. And then the rain comes in tomorrow night. Another round going into early Friday morning. And then we'll get some clearing for the afternoon. Looks mild, but uh, could be relatively unsettled for the upcoming weekend. Temperatures have rebounded nicely since the sun has come out. Wide range here, uh, pretty much depending on just how much sun you received. As warm as 53 in northeast of Penn State Bear in Union City, 47. Liz, sun coming out, as is Becky French Creek, mid to upper 40s there. Edinburgh probably past 50 right now. McCain has 48, and now toward Fairview it is 50 degrees. Marcus, out in Cambridge Springs, up to 50 degrees, 51 out toward Crossingville, Meadville, 51. Ed, uh, the sun came out a little later, but you'll catch up. He may be close to 50 as well. Out toward Saybrook, where the clouds have been hanging around the longest, you can see temperatures cooler there at 41. But he's also seen a few peaks of sun. So there you can see it, the clearing skies here. And uh, if you look closely, you find a couple of those, uh, those little dots there. Those are new cumulus clouds forming. And we'll see some of those form to a greater or lesser extent. But the clearing, a little more extensive than anticipated, despite this little upper-level system here over the lake. That's why I'm thinking as it moves east, it may help develop more clouds. But let's enjoy that sunshine for now. No precipitation expected here. You can see uh, by tonight, uh, things will be uh, at least partly cloudy, if not mostly clear. And we'll have a nice start to the day tomorrow. Good, strong, southerly flow. Temperatures well into the 50s in the morning, breaking near 60 until about mid-afternoon. Here you can see the front goes through. The front itself, not much with it, just some scattered showers, but the wind shift will make our temperatures drop here in Erie mid and late afternoon with the wind coming off that 37-degree lake water. <clears throat> in the meantime, a lot of rain for tomorrow night, but most of it out by 8 or 9 o'clock Friday. Wind shift toward the north, and that means some cooler air and maybe a little sunshine by late in the day. For today, uh, here along the lake shore, looking at uh, partly cloudy skies overall, temperatures uh, in the mid-50s for the most part. And on the inland side, you have a mix of clouds and sunshine. Your highs in the lower to mid-50s, Chautauqua, Ganey area. Uh, you'll have clouds and some sun and temperatures, uh, depending on how much sun comes out, upper 40s to the mid-50s. Partly cloudy for tonight. Not too bad, they're becoming breezy. Chance of afternoon showers tomorrow after some morning sunshine. Temperatures near 60, dropping to near 50 here in Erie by late in the day with that wind coming off the lake. Showers for Thursday night, that will continue into Friday morning early. That 51 is probably an early high. Most of the day we'll find temperatures mid to upper 40s. Scattered showers and thunder on Saturday.